something that we that I found out and Yay. <sighs> that I have to share with you, Mer uh, Mersh, and I'm very this is a, this is a fun thing, but um, I um, well we um, here's the thing, mm -hmm. uh, Mark Harley. Mm -hmm. Hello, Mark Carley. Hello, Mark Carley did an AMA. Hello, Mark. On I Reddit. Heard, I heard now, some messages and some things. Yeah, but here's the thing with the AMA he did. I haven't read it. Virgil went out, show it to me. He wanted to wait till the show started. He mentions us. Oh, boy. Yeah. So, um, flatteringly, I'm assuming. For those that yeah. don't know, and before we get to the AMA, just, just let, me, let me run like a quick, you know, just a quick kind of update. Uh, this was him on an, another podcast. I don't know what podcast it was, but this is too lazy to try clip this, by the way. Did stick to Bobby? She, uh, there you go. Or Joe just came to the conclusion that they were out of line. I think it could be a little bit of both. I think Joe just likes to avoid drama as much as possible. Like, he mm -hmm. wants nothing to do with this, unfortunately. I mean, I'd love to see Brennan Schaub and Annie Letterman or Kalila on the Joe Rogan experience so. together. So also, Mark, he starts going yeah. off on Kalila right here, and he starts imitating her, and it's actually pretty funny. Very sadistic to Bobby. She, uh, You can find compilations of her attempting to humiliate him. Yes. I actually noticed it I've on, seen him. Yeah. Yeah. With us commentating over them, I know all of you have. We own that algorithm. When they came out on the H3 podcast, that was really, I'm sitting there watching it going, look at the way that she emotionally steamrolls over Bobby. He's saying, I'm uncomfortable doing something. Please stop doing this. Are you taking our talking points and using them as your own on this show? Yes. Those were our talking points. Am I incorrect? Yes. Those are basically what we said. Yes. Okay, cool. Yeah. That was great. Same no, no, no. shit. Don't be a. Bobby and I'm like right. that's classic abusive manipulative behavior she's remorseless I don't think she empathizes with people in a traditional way I think she has enough emotional intelligence to like pretend and and pay lip service to but that's yeah that's called a sociopath or a psychopath depending on how or a woman she go in therapy we were talking about how we have to respond I'm like shut the <laughs> Up, like, <laughs> what are you gonna brush it? It's not bad. Hey, hear me out. And I, I don't know if I should do this before we hear the AMA, but so let's hear the AMA first. Okay, so it's kind of the background a little bit. He's been going on, going to different shows and <clears throat> talking about it. He was on Red Bar, uh, too, and he brought some stuff up. Um, after the Red Bar thing, he went on Twitter and he like just dropped deep Brendan DMs and then he did an AMA over the weekend. Dropped a voice message too. Dropped the voice message. Yeah, that's correct. Um, well, Virgie, mm, okay. what's this AMA with Mar Hella Mark Carley? So he dropped a few little fun hints. Uh, mm -hmm. I have to. I have to go to the Adderall one after this. I have. We. I have to. But, oh, uh, that's his his merch. Yeah. So okay. here's the he said question. the Adderall one. Right? Oh, okay. Cool. Here, Here's here's the question. How do you feel about the way you're betrayed here? Or he broke betrayed, but he meant portrayed. Anyways, yeah. The way you're portrayed here. Lots of guys like to shit on your looks, personality, the way you carry yourself, and the things you say. Does that have an effect on you? Uh, and he he know. he made three bullet points. Okay, bullet point right? one. Bullet point one. When men shit on my looks, it kind of goes in one ear and out the other because I'm aware of how I look and I don't have any delusions about how hot or ugly I am. Some women, parentheses and men, find me attractive. <laughs> I'm sure many others don't. That's fine. Blah, 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 blah. Here's the good one. Mm -hmm. Two, the way I carry myself. I also feel like a lot of my online persona has been misinterpreted or been deliberately interpreted in the least charitable way possible. I know Revenge of the Sis isn't this subreddit, but maybe there's some overlap. But someone sent me this segment where they're ripping on an HWS clip. That's how he, uh, that's, that's how he will say. say. Oh, okay, yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah. I like it. Doesn't he, have, he's, he's briefs. He's a briefs. So he's too much branding. Time. I like it. Yeah. Go ahead. Virgie? Sorry, the kid was yelling at yeah, me. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I'm being obviously ironic with my faux narcissism. Like maybe talking about being a, one of the world's most successful plus size male stop. models. He's doing stop. A, he's doing stop. a character. Stop for a second, so Virgie. He's doing a character. So uh, everything was a bit. Okay. So what was your character? Idiot. Like I'm just trying to understand, Mark. I'm trying to hear you out here, man. But you're not helping yourself. You're kind of proving our point. But go I just ahead. play an yeah. arrogant douchebag right. on the internet. Mm -hmm. Like it's a character. Well, so does Mark. You'll get along. Uh, go ahead. <laughs> 
Go ahead, Virgie. <clears throat> Virgie? Virgie. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. The thing was yeah, muted. Go ahead, My go bad. Ahead. And they're shitting on me as if I'm being literal. But I get it. I invite the scrutiny. My issue with how I carry myself is I can be fucking awkward. I'm basically a muscular <coughs> nerd who's developed some good in-person social I skills. I hate him. He's I hate doing. Him. He's. I hate him. First off, you haven't developed anything. You're doing the thing we're you're, t- you're, saying you're literally full of shit Mark. about, and now you're doing. Hear me out. Let's do this. I think this is fair. And I'm of course this has to be unanimous. If you say no, we don't have to. But hear me out. Sh- should we invite? Hello, Mark Harley, to come on the show. Yeah, though we we're trying to get him on the show. Well, Mark. Well, now, but now let's now let's do the now we know he watches. Let's do the official invitation. Okay, Mark. Yes, we goof on you, obviously. Okay, I understand, and we'll agree that it's probably hell to work for Brendan Shaw. That's something that I don't think even Mercer or I will probably go like. I don't care who you are. I don't care how much you goof on you. That job has to fucking suck. We agree with that. Okay, come on. Let's have a Mark Harley redemption arc. Open invite. We're not gonna. We're not gonna fucking. We're not gonna ambush you. I don't know how we would ambush you. Yeah, we've already up, said like, all the worst yeah. things. So you're welcome to come on. You're welcome to tell us and tell us what cycle you're on. Uh, go ahead. Okay. Uh, <laughs> where was I? Oh, next line. Yeah. I am not cool, and anytime you see me acting cool. It's a fucking tongue-in-cheek joke for a Trust video. me, Mark. We can tell when you're acting. I've seen your shorts. <laughs> All right. And three, which goes... It basically, I don't even know why he divided it. It's literally the same fucking line of logic. It's retarded. People mostly criticize me in a general way about what I say. I see people say I'm like a bloviating, pseudo-intellectual, narcissist, narcissist word salad machine. That's us? That's what we said. We say that. We say that about you. Oh, cool. I I was looking for the clip because I've literally heard Mersh say that exactly. I know, but that's that's, that's why I know. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, That's funny. Oh, shit. But it doesn't land because I know that I communicate uh, communicate quite clearly. It lands. You're and spiraling on Reddit. It landed. Hold on. It was let more than a glancing this. blow. <coughs> let me let me read this all together. <laughs> it's when you. a fighter gets hit in the face. He's bleeding from the ears and he's lying to the ref and being like, "Oh, uh, fine." Didn't even hurt. You're talking to the corner post. <laughs> 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 I, lo- I love when you see those fights and they stop them, mm-hmm. and then the guys like, "Oh, come on, come on, man, come on, man!" Eyeballs like this- hanging out, <laughs> eyeballs oh, fucking hanging out. Like, no, 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 we're stopping this. And I think we all agree that, look, listen, Mark, we like busting your balls. Obviously, you make well, your atrophied balls. You make it easy, and he, they are. He's not enough. He knows not enough. He, he knows that he's going to be on TRT the rest of his life, and that's fine. So's Rogan, probably, but. I will I will say this. Yes. Do I out of the two people, obviously Brendan is the worst human being. I think do you agree with me on that? Mm-hmm. Brendan's the worst human being here, okay? Actually, Kalila's worse than you two. As a matter of fact, Mark, if we're making a list of it's people It's Kalila, Crystalia, Brendan. And you're like way down there. You're not. Yeah, really you're not even top ten. To be honest with you, like I, in my like my opinion, that's the dude, truth. You're just a big damn no, gay like, idiot. Brendan yeah. and like Kalila and shit, they're le- they're bad fucking people. You know yeah. what I mean? You're just Marcus, a dummy. Yeah, Mark is just a silly man. You're just an idiot that like buys black market fucking steroids on the internet. And oh God, fucking, and to quote Ronnie B, don't make you a bad person. Don't make you a bad person. But um, but steroid. We got any more illegal steroids back there? Fresh out. <laughs> Fuck. Um. Turn, well. Turns out he's got illegal other things too. Oh yeah, we're gonna get to that. We got some more in this AMA that's pretty fun. Um. Is that is 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 there more for that? This this section? Yeah, there there is. Okay, go uh, ahead. Uh, I I know that I communicate quite clearly and never pose as an expert when I'm not. I am a curious novice in many realms. I a hate true him. expert in virtually you nothing. You know what they say, curiosity I- killed the gay lion. <laughs> 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 
However, I've recently gotten over my self-consciousness about dispensing certain kinds of advice online like in fitness because I see here. Hold on. Let me just skip ahead to the part that I need to read for you. So I challenge anyone. If you think I'm a pseudo intellectual, roll the tape and let's discuss. Sure. If I'm a narcissist, roll the tape and let's discuss. Correct. If I'm a fake expert, roll the tape and let's discuss. If I'm a self-absorbed solipsist, sure, you're right. He if used... I'm a little self-destructive in service of providing entertainment, sure, you're right. If I have many flaws, big and small, things to work on as I grow as a human from time management to pronouncing certain words better, sure, you're right. But do I have a cluster B personality disorder? Hmm. <laughs> I don't think we ever said that. I, I, I said, did you? I did say Maybe. That. You know, I don't know. Maybe you do have... Co- wow, so you're just like quoting... Man, you like memorize our videos. That's pretty flattering. But it doesn't phase him. Man. He's not phased Look, by it, Mark, though. just come on the show, man. It doesn't bother him. Just come on the show. Let's settle this. Let's. You come on the show. We'll talk. And maybe at the end of the day, we'll have a big gay redemption arc. What do you think? <laughs> I like it. Big gay redemption big arc? Big gay lion, big gay redemption arc. <laughs> big gay redemption arc. All right? What do you think? Huh? Uh, okay, so about now, this the, the other stuff that I want to get into has more to do with him dishing on Brendan than less to do with him. I think that stuff was basically him addressing us. Yeah. Um, There's a couple other good fun ones. Okay, yeah, please. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Here's, here's one for you, Mersh. <laughs> on the most recent fight companion, Brendan said that he was doing 90 to 120 milligrams of Adderall per day. Do yeah, you, you know, have like any info about that. Yeah, you know, like death by a thousand cuts. Did you see that clip? Did you see that and, clip? Oh, death by a thousand. Cuts. Okay, check this out. Brendan, uh, so I, I, some comedian, it might have been Destafina, one of the comedians, made fun of Brendan, like you know, fuck me, you know, making fun of him. But he was talking about, yeah, you know, when I watched the, the Gringo Poppy special, it was like death by a thousand cuts, is what he said. So then on the fight companion, Brian Callen and Brendan are there, and so's Rogan, and then. Callan's talking and he goes, yeah, yeah, you know, like death by a thousand cuts. And he looks at Brendan, huh? And Brendan goes, fuck you, bro. Wow. All my life. Patrick sent it to me. There was here yesterday. He showed it to me. I was like, fuck. Wow. Yeah. Uh, so go ahead. Okay. Bring- All right. Uh, 120 milligrams Adderall per mm-hmm. day. Do you have any info about that? And also, do you realize how insane that is? This is three to four times the absolute maximum a doctor would prescribe anyone. At that point, he is causing irreversible blah, 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 blah. Mark but, Harley's answer. Mm-hmm. Mark Harley's answer. Mersh. Yes. Who do you think <coughs> got it for him? He got. He gets bop, bop by his Adderall. How much was he taking? 90 to 100 milligrams of Adderall a day. That's not good. Also. And he owes some money for is, it. This is the yeah. This is the other part. Also, hey fuckface, you stiffed me four hundred and fifty dollars on the last thirty I got you. So he's he owes him a debt. He put what? a ca- I think he, that one he put a cash app out and he just let it expire. Why are you? Yeah, I admitting to crimes though. <laughs> Even to throw him under the bus. <laughs> <laughs> well, he already went on the air and said he gets and he gets fucking steroids from the dark web, you know. No, I mean I get that, right? But there's a difference between yeah, okay, maybe I got some stuff for myself. To now, you're admitting to selling drugs illegally. I'd be like, oh, yeah. that's a control substance. Yeah, you're right. Good he, point. He also said that he just got off Adderall. I had a problem. Do you think he stopped taking it because it was a problem or because he just lost his plug, Mark? I mean, he only paid me for the last order when he'd run out, so he'd lay my old cash app, then demand more. Or First pay off, my why, why is he app. paying you for Adderall? You go to a doctor. They'll, it's Brandon so get a fucking easy to get Adderall now legally. You could do it online with a Skype yeah, call. Like, that's it's not. all it is. That's how I got. What? I have a doctor. I, he barely checks on me. Once in a while, he checks in and be like, all right, yeah, mm-hmm. fine. And then he just gets. Later on, in, later on in the same thread. <laughs> later on in the same thread. 450 for 30 30 milligrams is a good deal. Can you help me? Can you be my new blog, Papa? Mark replies, I actually offer to teach people how to use the dark web because it's annoying to constantly be getting people shit when I don't want to profit off it. For, for, first off, 
let me explain He's, something. Mark, for a, smart, <laughs> for a smart guy, you go about things a real weird way. First off, you don't need to go to the dark web to get Adderall. You go to the regular web to get Adderall, all right? Let's start that. I'm not going to get too into specific details, but it ain't that difficult. It's pretty fucking easy. And if you don't mind tasting bitter research chemicals, you get it legally here, too. So let's calm down. But also, don't be teaching people how to use the fucking dark web, you fucking moron. I would vary you. I'd get off the fucking dark web. He's got to be All careful right. with that Adderall shit, though, because if yeah. that's true, uh, honestly, you should The ice cream thing isn't true. You shouldn't ever. You really should never be taking 40, more than 40 a day. 60 a day, maybe, if you've really mm -hmm. got an issue. Um, like, I take half of a 20 twice a day. Mm -hmm. So I take 20 milligrams a day over the course of a whole day. A hundred and thirty, like, I'm almost curious, like, if I wasn't old and fat and out of shape and worried about my heart, I'd almost want to try that just to see how much I'd get done. Right. But I think I would just be in a fucking psychosis. Yeah. So, wait, so, from my understanding, and Virgil, you read more of this than me, basically, he was just kind of like, he, he, Brandon treated him kind of like a go-boy. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, and like a, sorry, he actually mentions that. In we kind of always had that assumption about him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but like, the way that Mark presents it, like from his perspective, he he kind of he was just gullible and didn't really realize it, like didn't realize that he, he was being used. What he thought he was used to being used for his vast intellect. Well, yeah, yeah he, he thought so. he thought they were friends. Was. Yeah, that's literally what he says. He was like, "I thought we were friends and shit." And he's just like pretty much using me. Do you want to? Do you want to get into why he's so fucking angry? Yes, please. Steroids. Uh, so somebody asked, "Can you elaborate on the lying about money comment?" Yes, he took me off Thick Boy Payroll, one of three sources I was paid from, Thick, TGH, and TFATK, reducing my monthly pay by over a 1000 without telling me, but also reprimanded me, then later fired me for, in part, not showing up to work on Shab Show, which is part of Thick. Two, various times promised certain independent contract pay, like Happy Hippo ad reads for $1,000 a month, and later say, oh, I meant... That was for you and Chappelle combined, so it's actually five hundred dollars a month. He was I mean, telling him he was getting ad reads and he was mm -hmm. splitting them. I believe that. Oh, Here's the thing. Oh boy. Listen, Mark, I'll give you this. I believe that. These are things that sound one hundred well, first off, what a what a weird exact detail. Why would you make that up? Like that's not a lie you would make up. Oh, no, he's not bullshitting. I yeah. to be honest with you. This I believe. Like, hundred percent believe this. No, if, from reading this thread and reading his answers and how fucking candid he is, mm -hmm. look, man, uh, Mark is a fucking... Dummy. All the things that we've said about him, there's one thing Mark Harley is not, and that's a fucking liar. No, I don't, he think, he's, I don't think he's been lying about any of this stuff. Yeah, no, that's a good dude, point. I believe give him 110%. He is not a he's liar. He's a doofus, but he's not a liar. How much, no, was, how, how much was it he said Callum was getting paid for uh, Fighter and the Kid a month? There's 25 Gs, I think. Yeah, it was something 25 like that. G's, 25 G's yeah. a month. That must so, be nice. Just to show up in sandals and sit Indian style. Uh, sit. Or sorry, crisscross <laughs> applesauce. I don't want to offend anybody. Um, <laughs> uh, Go ahead. So uh, actually $500 a month. I mean, I don't even make $1,000 a month from Happy Hippo ad reads, huh? Also, luckily found written proof that contradicts uh, the framing of this. Promised 3K Tiger thick pay a month, then later his manager called when I invoiced it and was like, oh, yeah, that's for you and Jay, who wasn't really doing much at all. Wait a second. Yeah. The 3K, you were supposed to get 3K a month, which, okay, uh -huh. you know, you could livable, barely, but livable. It, it, where you are, you know, with other 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 money you're making. Well, that but was then, just for the that one pay. Because no, 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 no. I, I know, I know, I know. No, 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 no. I know, I know, I know. But 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 then after saying that, then go no no. I meant split it. That yeah. sounds like first off, you know what it sounds like, and this is why we said Mark, you're not even like the top tenth worst person out there. Not even top ten. You don't break the you're top not 10. even. Yeah, you're not even a fucking top fifty worst person in L. A. No, in L. A. <laughs> so to be fair, if you can take anything Some out of this clip, fuck kids and yeah, stuff. if you so, take I mean, anything, they're really bad people. I will say this: if you take anything out of this clip, know that yeah. I think you're stupid. We think you're kind of dumb. It's we kind think of you're a smug idiot, but I you're a smug you. dummy. You're pseudo intellectual, but honestly, we don't hate you. But Brendan is a hateable person. 
you know what I mean? Oh, he's a piece of shit. And I believe yeah. every word that fucking he's saying. And like this, mm. he's a piece of shit. That's bro. a good point. Somebody you, you, you ran in the chat said, looks, Mark is Mark. And that's true. I mean, he is yeah. what he is, but which is fine. So he, he, the pay thing, I believe it's almost like Brendan doesn't know how to run a fucking company. Yeah, and he's weird. afraid to ask for help because one, it would cost him money, and two, he wouldn't seem like a self-made man like Rogan, because that's who Brendan wants to be. Brendan, Brendan Schaub wants to be Joe Rogan. There's no question about it. You know? Yeah. Whoa, I mean. hold on. I just read ahead. Mm -hmm. Also, he claimed it was my job to do security for him on the road, but did not pay me for the roughly fifty hours a weekend minimum, where technically I was on the job. I got no extra money for being on the road, but mocks how shitty I am at my security job in his act. Mark does my security, but he's always on his phone, so if you want to murder me, now's your chance. You know who's always on his phone except when he needs narcissistic supply from others around him? Brendan. He's literally jealous of people's phones. So. <laughs> that's that was very funny. funny. That's actually that very was, funny. That was funny. <laughs> Big gay redemption arc. You guys think I'm kidding. Big gay redemption I'm arc turning coming. around on this guy. Big gay redemption arc. I don't know, man. The honesty in it is kind of endearing. Mm -hmm. Like, just that alone, it's like, man, you're just a silly, goofy fucker. But like, you're not a bad person. Here's what I'm gonna do: just to show Olive Branch. Here's an Olive Branch merch. You've now been upgraded from Big Gay Lion to Big by Curious Lion. There you go. That's an upgrade. Okay. I don't hate it. A BBC. L. Hear me out. I think you need to move to <laughs> there you go. You need and you need to move to Nashville, become a uh, an acolyte of Theo Vaughn. All right, get him hooked on Adderall and steroids. Oh, he's here here fucking actually fucking they mentioned imagine Theo Vaughn just gets fucking jacked. Jacked and fucking wired. Yeah. All the time. Just <laughs> wired. Just Ooh, shit. Just oh, didn't did didn't did didn't yeah, didn't just did it was got, was, it, it. was yeah. Can so, you get get to the Theo one? Remember because remember that so, whole that whole kerfuffle, if you will, about the oh, the, the, flyer. the flyer. Yeah, this this is this is, this is the last one we'll do. But okay, go ahead. so the this comment was deleted by the user, but you can you can tell by what the, it was. The yeah, what it was. At first, I believed Brendan that Theo had really committed to it and threw him under the bus. Brendan was heated, but I was like, okay, dude, if he's throwing you under the bus publicly, then mm -hmm. you got to say something. Be like, LOL, that's funny, Theo. You agreed to it. We both know. His unwillingness to do that makes me very skeptical it went down like he claims. Not saying Theo is totally innocent, but it's 90-10, 80-20, Bapa Theo. He calls so, him Bapa. I, I, really Bapa. Bapa. He's using... <laughs> <laughs> big gay redemption arc mark big gay redemption arc buddy 